Hey, Coach, congrats on the win. Thank uh, you. Before, before the game, you were asked what a key word for the rest of the season with this team would be, and you said mindset. How did you feel that the team's mindset was tonight in getting this victory? Um, I thought it was good. You know, I thought they, you know, Philly came out, jumped out to an early lead, and, you know, we kept our composure. You know, having um, Mike Scott at the five kind of put us in a tough situation with Zoo at the five, but uh, we figured it out. You know, we kept playing. And uh, like I said, our mindset was right. You know, it was hard to get stops tonight because of the way they played with the small lineup. But I thought offensively we did a lot of great things, attacking the paint, making the extra pass, making the play. And, you know, having 30 uh, points in the paint in the first half was good for us. Go to Claudia. Hey, Ty. Congratulations on the win. Thank when you. you look at when you look at how Terrence Mann and Reggie Jackson played tonight and in recent games, how much will this team depend on them going forward? Um, they've been doing great. You know, I think, you know, Reggie, um, like I said, a solid veteran point guard who stepped in and has played well, you know, every time Pat Bev was out. So um, he's been great for us. But team man's growth, uh, just, you know, each game, you know, getting better and better. And um, his confidence is, you know, through the roof right now. And um, he brings that energy and effort. You know, he's making shots and attacking the basket. You know, we're a totally different team. Thank you. Law, you can go ahead. You, you brought up before how I can't hear you. Can you hear me now? Yes, yeah, a little better. Okay, uh, sorry, there's some math probably. Um, you, you brought up before how uh, Doc told you that if you wanted to coach, you know, just hit him up, and you took him up on that. And you know, I see the, uh, Rajon Rondo tonight. You know, he's interacting with the coaching staff, interacting with the players. I Yeah, Law, you're you're pretty low. Uh, we'll come back to you if we can, Law. We'll go to uh, we'll go to Andrew. I hope I'm not. I hope I'm not stealing Law's question. Um, I was just curious watching Rajan on on the sideline talking to Jeremy, talking to Chauncey. Uh, even in his first game, you talk about how smart he is, and, and Lawrence called him a savant. Is he giving you ideas even in this first game uh, for what he's seeing? No, he was just asking a lot of questions, you know, as far as the play calls and, you know, how, what we were running, what we were looking for, and just trying to stay engaged and just trying to get the play calls. You know, that's what he does. And um, Jeremy was helping him a lot, you know, rewinding some of the video, um, showing him plays. And then a couple times I called a play, you know, with my mask, and he couldn't really hear. So he was asking what, what was the play call and um, just trying to understand, you know, what we're looking for and what we're trying to do offensively. Go to Nick Hamilton. Hey, Coach, uh, congratulations on the win. Uh, when you look at Terrence Mann and you look at his just uh, maturity throughout the season, it seems like he's really playing with a lot of uh, confidence, a lot of maturity, but also fluidity in the offense. Uh, what does that attest to as far as what are you seeing in practice that that we're all, we're now seeing uh, on the floor? Well, I just think our player development group has done a great job. You know, like I said, with Kenny Atkinson and Chauncey and Dante Jones, you know, Sean Fine's done a great job, you know, with his, you know, with T-Man shooting. I mean, shot has changed. And I'm um, just putting in the work every single day. You know, those guys playing four on four, five on five, um, being able to compete every single day. And then just, you know, like I said, he's having the confidence of being able to play off the basketball and just be, you know, the player that he is, just slashing to the to the basket, you know, offensive rebounds, rebounding, pushing the break. Um, so just having a lot in this game and now being able to play with confidence as well. I took him to another level. Shane Young, you go ahead. Hey, Ty, it seems like over the past few games, the point of attack defense in the pick and roll has been a lot better. They only gave up 16 attempts in the restricted area tonight. What have you thought about like the point of attack defense from the guards? Um, been pretty, been pretty good. You know, I thought we'd give a little too many threes. Just um, threes we talked about, like with Danny Green, you know, running him off the three point line. You know, don't let him get his feet set. Um, falling asleep in transition. You know, when guys are penetrating with the pitch backs, like we know Ben Simmons wants to attack early and pitch it back for three. So just taking those those seven or eight shots away, um, overall, like I said, I thought the point of attack defense was pretty good. Rashawn, you can go ahead. All right, Coach. Um, how difficult or, or what are the challenges going to be in fighting man minutes once you get Pat back and once Rondo gets acclimated? Um, we got to see. You know, we just got to just continue to keep playing with the rotations. Now we got to start all over again and see who fits with who and who works well together. But, you know, right now we're in a good rhythm. 
you know, I'm a liking where I, you know, all our guys, you know, playing, playing, playing pretty decent. So um, when those guys come back, we just got to figure it out. We got time for one more. We'll go to Miriam. Hey, Ty. You know, the All-Star bait kind of came at the right time for you guys um, to kind of regroup. Um, and this nine-game homestand, to have this coming to you right when you get Rondo and kind of is it going to be helpful to sort of incorporate him to kind of have this extra practice time? Yeah, it's going to be it's very, very helpful for us. Um, you know, um, soon as soon as the, um, he got traded, he asked for the playbook, so we've been studying that already. And we're going to continue to keep bringing the young guys in with them, you know, on all days, on practice days, just making sure we're trying to get them up to speed. Thanks, Coach. Have yourself a great evening. Thank you.